Hi Mikes, I'm Jessica and you're watching SBTV. We are making stories by teens for teens. Creating a platform, finding character, and giving others a voice. This is SVTV. Students still have access to the library services. Email Ms. Esser if you have any questions. Final schedule is on Schoology, so go check it out. With COVID-19, the boys' swim season is going to look a little different. Let's go check out the changes. With coronavirus sending us all home for remote learning, let's see how the boys' swim team is going to keep practicing during the break. Um, well, I'm hoping, uh, you know, strong performance. You know, we always have goals of do strong, doing strong finishes in uh, city, league, and state. Um, last year, especially, we finished fifth in state, and so hoping to have a strong finish there. Um, and a strong finish in league, especially with, you know, leaving our league in, like, the next year or two, um, having a strong last couple of years in the league as well. Um, well, for COVID this year in swim and at the downtown Y, I've broken the guys are separated in two different groups, um, practicing for only an hour each. Um, with so the numbers are about half, so about uh, ten in one group and about fifteen in the other. And then um, the guys are also um, starting at, at opposite ends of the pool with uh, their specific lane assignments as well. Um, and then masks are worn up until right before you get in the water and then right when you get out of the water. They're going to be excited for no matter what um, type of season we'll have, whether it's a shortened season or a full season. I just look forward to a really good swim season. We wish the boys good luck on their season. Any students interested in playing in the Police Athletic League can pick up an information sheet in the main office. Registration deadline is December 16th. Auditions for the Seaman High School Musical Working will be held December 8th and 10th at 3.30 in the choir room. Please check out the Theater School you page for song information. We have another Get to Know Your Students, this time with Josie Esser. Um, Stella is a Nufifu, which is a mix between a Newfoundland and a Poodle. She's, oh gosh, ten, 10 weeks, 9 weeks, somewhere in between. We got her two weeks ago, almost two weeks ago on Wednesday. I like how fluffy she is because we don't have fluffy dogs and she's a fluffy dog. She's just a cute, lovable dog. <laughs> Josie's dog is adorable. Key Club members will have an online meeting today at 3.05 in the Google Meet. Math Club will be having a Math League 6 question quiz on Friday, December 11th at 1 p.m. for any students to take for free. Contact Mr. Hebert if you have any questions. Now over to Zoe for our weather announcements. Good afternoon, Vikings. We didn't get any snow or rain this morning, but we do still have a slight chance of rain throughout the rest of today. Today is going to be very chilly with our temperatures remaining mostly in the 30s, possibly dipping up into the lower 40s area. For your SVTV 7-day forecast, this precipitation is going to move out today and we are going to have the sun return. And in result of this, our temperatures are going to be warming back up into the 50s area and even possibly touching the 60s next week. Now back to your anchors. Thanks, Zoe. That's all for today, Vikes. Have a great rest of your day.